it is Tuesday morning. Got my coffee, and I've been working with uh, an Azure VM here that I created. Virtual machine called, I call it Cold Fusion VM. It has Windows Server 2022, IIS with the basic IIS website over port 80 installed, and also has Cold Fusion 2023 development options selected. And over here in the networking settings, I have the network security group, and it's G, and in there I have two inbound ports, one for 80, one for 8500. I'm not utilizing 443, and RDP, of course, is uh, available to look at. Now, over on the server here, I have uh, IIS, obviously, there, the default website. Uh, this is where I uh, uploaded the, the install for Cold Fusion. I went ahead and installed Cold Fusion, and everything works here. This is Cold Fusion Administrator, and uh, and then this right here is IIS, basic IIS website. And this right here is just a hello world, Cold Fusion CFM file running. Um, that's all that is. And that's about all I want to show you here. So uh, the problem I'm having is uh, I've opened up these at the 8500 port, but for the public ID 4282, that's the public IP. It doesn't seem to like it. And this is uh, 172, 172, 178, 4282. Um, and then, of course, it's not going there. Here's just normal IIS or port 80. That's the public IP. Uh, this is the hello, this would be the hello world site right here. Uh, that's installed. The only thing I haven't tried is just disabling the firewall on the server. Let's see. I used, it's been a while. So the firewall is on. Let's do public network um, health protect your device. Turn that off. Go back. Firewall is off. Let's turn the firewall off. I, I, I forgot about doing these. I used to do this all the time. And uh, Windows Defender is off. So now, let's see if that solves the problem for the server. Will it work? Hey, I, guess I just got it. Ha <laughs> ha. And here is, of course, it has wants me to log in. There we go. That is the Cold Fusion uh, 2023 release.